Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Spain and the United States concluded the Treaty of San Lorenzo on this day, October 27, in 1795, also known as Pinckney's Treaty. This document was an important diplomatic success for America, as it resolved territorial disputes between the two countries. Prior to the treaty, the western and southern boundaries of the United States had been a source of tension between Spain and the United States. While the U.S. border extended to the Mississippi River, the southern stretch remained in the Spanish territory and Spain was reluctant to encourage trade and settlement along the frontier. Two, Spain kept the Mississippi River closed to American shipping. Therefore, the treaty was extremely important for Natchez because it granted American ships the right to free navigation of the Mississippi River, as well as duty-free transport through the port of New Orleans, which was then under Spanish control. It also gave America the east bank of the Mississippi River above the 31st parallel. Negotiated by Thomas Pinckney, a South Carolinian and a minister to Great Britain, the treaty was finally ratified in April 1796. Spanish authorities, however, would remain in Natchez until the spring of 1798. My name is Tate Hobde. I've lived in Natchez, Mississippi all my life. I'm with Stevenson Hobde Insurance, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.